Senator Gillibrand. Thank you, Senator Schumer. Um, I want to thank our governor for um, really being here when we need you uh, to be at the forefront of the state's response to work together with our local government to get things done for the many, many thousands of families who have been harmed, who have lost loved ones, who have lost their homes and their business. So thank you, Governor, thank you. for standing ready and strong to help the state in this time of need. And to Senator Schumer, uh, who I've witnessed at every disaster uh, since I've been in the Senate with him, and I remember the days after Super Storm Sandy and the devastation that that wrought. I remember being here in Westchester with the number of lines that were down, the number of trees that destroyed homes, the number of people who were killed. Um, we have been hit by these severe weather storms constantly over the last decade, constantly. And Senator Schumer's quite right that the federal government has a real responsibility. Uh, we have the responsibility of making sure the Army Corps of Engineers shows up, to make sure they do the work, to make sure that we build resiliency for the next time. Senator Schumer and I have been working in the Build Back Better plan for President Biden to put money in that bill for resiliency so that we can actually protect homes, families, individuals from these super storms that keep crushing our state. I, I'm sure uh, you know the stories of what's happened. Um, infants drowning in their homes, families dying because the water's rushing in and they can't get out. Now, Westchester has some really good stories because we have first responders who were able to save people, to save people by boat, to be able to show up, to evacuate them. So we are grateful for each one of you, uh, our first responders, our firefighters, uh, the people who are on the front lines to literally save lives every day. Our heart goes out to you and our gratitude goes to you and your families for all the sacrifice you make. I also want to be thankful to our local government representatives that are here, our county executive, our assembly members, our congress member, um, and our local reps. They're in the community every day, so they're the ones who are answering the questions, getting the resources, making sure people have food and clothing and the things that may have been washed away. That is what you do, and so I just want to thank all of our local representatives. And last, um, we have to recognize this is not the end. Uh, this is just the next big storm, and this country is being devastated from flooding, from tornadoes, from wildfires. This is the impact of global climate change on our new normal. And it is devastating. It is heartbreaking. It is deadly. And so you have a team of elected leaders here uh, with Senator Schumer as our majority leader that are gonna do everything we can in this moment in time to not only help those recover with the resources that FEMA will get them, and other resources that our governor will get them, and the resources that our state electeds and local electeds will get them. But we have to work harder to make sure this doesn't keep happening. And that is an entire whole of government response. And so thank you, Senator Schumer, for bringing us together. And thank you for everyone here who is fighting so hard to protect our families and to prevent the next one. Thank you, Senator Gillibrand.